you were gaming rules. You got wrong. Welcome, War Gamers. Josh here to bring you this week's rules you got wrong for X Wing. Let's jump right into it. First game we're going to talk about is Empire vs. Rebels X Wing Bat Rep, uh, episode 43. First one is from Chi Kun Jodo one. That's what I'm going to go with. At 42 minutes, if you declare a barrel roll, you must perform it unless it's impossible. So you had room to perform the barrel roll, but friendly game, so I guess it's all good. That one's more my fault than anything else. Uh, I kind of rushed him into picking an action. Should have given him a second or two, cut the clip, and let him pick. Uh, completely my mistake. It made sense after he had a second or two to look at it that he wasn't going to barrel roll. So that's that's my bad for trying to rush him through. So 100%, yeah, if you declare a barrel roll, you have to do it. I eh, just didn't really give him the chance to think about it. So that is 100% on me as opposed to David White. Next comment from uh, T-Bolt plays X-Wing. P.S. That last turn, David cheated. He cleared his stress after a white maneuver. Tisk tisk LOL. As much as I love to call David White a cheater, because he's not really one, you know, huge basic little mistakes. The maneuver that he did, the bank, he had twin ion engines up, so that actually technically was a green maneuver. So he was fine to clear that one you made the mistake on, as opposed to David White. So, not saying David White's not a cheater. He's going to yell at me for that. Next comment is Joshua Ty one at 4224, the Glaive Squadron pilot takes an evade action push to the limit, but TIE defenders can't actually evade. They only have barrel roll, focus, and target lock. You are 100% right, and neither myself nor David White caught that one. They can't take the evade action, so our bad on that. We're going to jump over to Empire vs. Empire, episode number 44. J Ty 314159. At 2.16, Captain Jonas has the TIE shuttle upgrade, which prevents him from taking a bomb. This means that he couldn't have the proximity mines. Still a really fun bat rep, though. I thoroughly enjoy getting to see the bombers and defenders in action. Again, 100% right. Completely missed that one. I think David White and I both knew that and just did not catch that at all. So yes, if you take the sh TIE shuttle upgrade, it prevents you from taking any of the ordnance you normally would. That wraps up the rules you got wrong for this week for X-Wing. Thanks for tuning in and keep them coming. Happy Wargaming.